Are they raiding? Oh, they are. Look, we got a raid going on. This dude over here is fighting the fisherman. Hold on, let's get down low. And watch. Yeah, the fisherman just beat his ass. Hello, everybody. Great show, please. We're back with more Deus Sim. You guys seem to enjoy this game, and I do as well. We have some interesting stuff happening over here. We do have a potential attack city right over here. What is going on in it? Are they defending, attacking, or what? You can see there's one blue guy or girl technically hanging out over there. Everyone else seems to be red. I do kind of feel like I'd like to get an attack or a raid or something going this time because I think that would be kind of cool. Uh, but first things first, I think what I'm going to do, I'm just taking a look real quick at the rest of our settlements here. I think everything else is doing very well except for this one area. So what we're going to do is I'm going to cast some thunder on them and see how they enjoy that. I wonder if, uh, well, they're not going to enjoy it, I imagine. But I wonder if that will take things to a new level with the thunder and the lightning. How do you guys like the thunder and the lightning? Something I was reading, it said that using thunder in the mountains or something like that causes a little bit more of an effect. Uh, I don't know. Let's see here. I don't know what we could use to get a little bit more belief in our system. There's some locusts. Everyone always loves locusts. And after the locust swarm of sadness... Let's see, perhaps let's, um, let's do some regen or something like that. Maybe some regen. Oh, look at that. We've got some more going on over there. Now, every once in a while, we still have some scumbags that we've got to deal with. And deal with we will. The old-fashioned way. The way that everyone will know who the deity is in Deusim. By throwing people into the cosmos. That was really weird. They never landed. Like, their body never hit the ground. It just went on and on forever. Uh, let's do some more stuff over here. I'm going to throw down some rain. There we go. Oh, look, that guy's really happy about it raining. So now it's freezing and it's cold and rainy. But everyone's totally okay with that. Whatever. Ooh, we actually have quite a few places over here that are getting a little bit annoyed. Yeah, you can see right over here, getting very annoyed, not happy. Something I found is we need to put mountains near... What was that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and prepare the rain, folks. Let's go ahead and prepare the rain and get over here. We got problems. We got problems. Rain for days. Rain over there as well. I'm going to take care of this forest fire one way or the other. I think we got it taken care of. I think pretty much we got it taken care of. Now, there's a lot more. I'm going to try and do this while everything else is going completely insane. There's a lot more ways for us to be mobile. I've turned a lot of them on. You can do a lot of different mobility things for this. One thing that we can do is use our thumb buttons here. And we can, like, drag ourselves around like this. This is okay. I don't know if I mind this. It's actually quite uh, peaceful to do things this way. Like, everything's very smooth. As we move around, oh, for the love of God, what's going on over here now? People are annoyed over here as well with their low faith and stuff. Okay, well, how about some rain for you? From what I understand, rain in the desert is very, very awe-inspiring. They really love the rain in the desert. Oh, we have another ability too. Oh, and besides that, and I'll do it real quick, we can go ahead and zoom in and out by holding down our thumbs and kind of like bringing them together. And then on top of that, we can twist and turn with our thumb buttons as well. Um, I think that's pretty cool. I kind of like that. I really, I really like being close to the ground. I know a lot of people seem to like being close to the ground too because it allows you to kind of like get a better overview. Let me see if I can turn us right about there. It allows us to get a better overview. You can't get as much done. It just looks cooler. That's, that's really what I like about it. So you can see we do have a dubious looking red dude over here. So we are going to have to take care of him without me hopefully hitting the old green screen. Throw a little bit more rain over here. Come on, people. There we go. Now they're wearing the blue garbs. Now they care about us. Uh, do I want to? Yeah, well, teleportation works okay. Let us go and move languidly. Auto saving in slot zero. Okay. Haven't seen that come up yet, but whatever. That's totally fine. As we deityize our way over here, we can see this guy was killed. But what killed him? Was it starvation or, or sadness? Okay, his body's gone. What can you do? So this is an area that's kind of... What is that over there? Hold on, we're going to deal with them in a second. There's cool stuff going on over here. Oh, it's like a water-based pyre. Look at this. That's cool. I haven't seen it. There's another one over there. Oh, that's so neat. Hold on. Let's let's check this out. How, how far down can I go? Oh, this is as far down as I can go. Let's check this out, though. I haven't really seen anything like that before. Oh, they got a golden fish. I don't know why, but their fish over there is like made of gold and power. It's pretty cool, actually. Let's head back over here. This little village needs a little bit of a beating. 
And we can certainly do that. Now, the other thing that we have is the Void ability, which is really sweet. We have the ability to delete an area and turn it into another area, which we're probably going to do. But first things first. Before we See, there's the Void right there. Before we do all that, I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and rain on these people's parades. Okay, let's try that one more time without failure as an option. I'm going to go ahead and rain on these people's parades. There we go. Things are getting a little bit better. How about another rain cloud for you? You guys enjoying that? Are you impressed by it? Is it cool enough for you yet? We can also do some regen if we wanted to. A heal. Does that do anything? Do they care about that at all? Oh, wow. They really care about that. Look at that. Turn them right from uh, the white garbs to the blue garbs. And you can see. Hold on now. Right over here. A classic scumbag. Oh, classic scumbag right over here. You know what? We Oh, wow. The I think I just beat them into the side of a house. I think I just beat their sad, broken body into the side of one of the houses. I did not mean for that to happen. Let us race our way over here briefly. Look at how many boats are on the water. It's such a small, sad little lake. And yet there's so many boats over here. Like, does this really need that many boats? These people need a mountain over here, I do believe. So let us go ahead and do that briefly. We'll use our void ability in just a minute. Wow, I completely forgot how easy this stuff throws in this game. I've been so used to other games where I have to throw like I'm trying to pitch a freaking home run. And over here is substantially different. Okay, so another mountain over there. And a mountain over here like this. And you know what? Why not? One over here as well. Over here by the evil land, everyone not impressed with how well I've been doing my job. So a little bit of that right there should turn the grouping around. And then a little bit of rain as well should get everyone a little bit more on our side. And then, you know what, while we're at it, let's just get rid of this guy right now. Like I said, I do eventually want some uh, fighting, like some infighting, but I wanna get these, these villages established a little bit first. So now they have mountains nearby. They're gonna need some water nearby as well. So let's go ahead and do that. We're gonna put down some water real quick right over here. Here we go. A little bit of water right there. A little bit of water. Wow, I really threw that like I was going for the... There it is. That's what I'm talking about. A little bit of water right there. More right there. There we go. That should be plenty of water for them right now. In fact, we can probably put this out even a little bit further if we want to. And then, let's try... We'll do one more. Let's try the void real quick. So now we have some mountains fairly... So yeah, you can see. See right there how they're bringing stone over? That's why some of the villages would never prosper, because they didn't have any stone. So let's twist ourselves around over here, like so. And, uh, you know, you guys are going to have to let me know. What do you guys like more? Do you like the teleporting, like this? Or do you like the kind of, like, walking like this? Which one's a little bit more impressive to you? Feel free to leave that in the comments section below. We'll, we'll use whatever one people have a little bit easier time watching. I can see some evil over there. That's just fine. Let us, uh, what do I want to do over here? We have a lot of mountains. They need more space. I can tell you right now. So let's put down a little bit more forest. Maybe another forest over here. And some more regular ice or plains, however you want to look at it. Right over here. This way they have some additional expansion area. And that should get them kind of moving on the correct path. Now these individuals over here. I think I'm going to zoom out. Every yeah, see that? Look at that. The houses are starting to become more and more impressive as they have stone to use. And there's stone all over here, so everyone should be really happy. So the reason that these houses over here are stuck in wood is because they don't have any mountains. And we can fix this. Uh, as a matter of fact, let's try our void ability. I said I, I've said I was going to try it. Let's try it. So we have void. So, whoa! Oh, that drove everyone into a corner. That made everyone live in fear. And I hit my green screen. <laughs> Let's put a mountain here. Put a nice mountain right there. There we go. Now everyone can utilize this mountain for their resources. Of course, I think I gave everyone a heart attack over here. So void, very, very fear inspiring. Holy crap, is it fear inspiring. Like, if I void over here, are, is it going to wipe out those houses, I wonder? I mean, it's worth a shot. Let's check it out. So if I void over here. Oh, that was weird. It didn't void anything. Do I, uh, I must not have, I must not have selected it. There, let's try, there we go, there we go. I bet I had, uh, water or something like that. Okay, it didn't, it didn't destroy anything there, so that was good. Let's put down a mountain. 
right over here. There we have it. And now, they should be able to grab the resources from that. Yeah, you can see them right over here. Let me see if I can, uh, see if I can get down low. Get down low so we can watch over here. Forge for some berries. Yeah, they got little pickaxes and stuff. Look at them go. Look at them go. Every once in a while, the twisty turnies are giving me a little bit of a freaking problem over here. But it's not a huge deal. Got a fish going on. That dude that was harvesting the resources over here is gone. I don't know. There he is. He's over there. It's like, oh, they go into the mountain. They straight up just fade right into the nether realm of the mountain. Whatever. That's fine. All right. Now, this is one of my favorite cities over here. This one right here. But I'm going to let them be evil and sad. What are you guys building? You see how they were hammering away at something. Whoa. Okay. All right. I mean, I, I hate an evil person as much as the next. But wow, look at those people on fire. Oh, there was people on fire over there, but we just saved them. And now, oh, the crap. Um, come here, rain. Come here, rain. Oh, can we get it way downtown? Yep, we sure can. With a little hit of the, uh, <laughs> with a little hit of the green screen, everything is back to normal. And, oh, is there more? Oh, my God. Look over here. Hold on. We're going to need to teleport for this. What's going on over here? What's wrong with you guys? You guys got the plague or something? Oh, no. You're just annoyed and sad. Um, I want to keep the evil on one side for right now. So you guys are going to have to learn what freaking time it is. With the thunder! With the thunder, run in fear. Run in fear, baby. No one's been fed to the freaking... No one's been fed to the freaking volcano in quite some time. It is time. Volcano must eat. Volcano... Wow. Again. I kind of forgot my own strength. I'm going to make sure that we can feed someone to the volcano. I'm not going to let you guys go volcano list. Hold on. Okay, you're it. You're going to go into the volcano whether you like it or not. I'm going to make this happen. There we go. All right, right over here. There we go. Man down. Man gets fed to volcano grace still plays style. That's how we do it. Over here, um, let us do a little bit of regenning. There we go. And now let's do a little bit of rain. Here we go. And now, you know what? We'll even do a heal. And that should make everyone super happy. We got two heretics over here. And I think, as a matter of fact, that we're going to go ahead and get rid of that one over there. And then, are you hiding inside this house? Get out of the house. Get out of the freaking... There we go. We got one more over here that we're going to have to deal with. So you get to go over there. And Wow, this there's like a freaking heretic populate. Oh, oh, crap. Oh, yep, just right over there, Mr. Home. Someone right now is like, I, honey, I could have swore we built our house on the other side of the meadow. Did you move it? Nope. That's just Deusim for you. Oh! Like, right before my eyes, the city just prospered. That was kind of cool. I guess they had gotten enough stone. I wonder if... Ooh, what is going on over here? Look at this place. Look at... Oh! Are they raiding? Oh, they are! Look, we got a raid going on! This dude over here is fighting the fisherman! Hold on, let's get down low and watch. Yeah, the fisherman just beat his ass! That's why you don't mess with a fisherman, buddy! Now you know! Now you know! So right over here, this is cool. I I'm gonna leave this. We have, like, the desert people versus the ice people. But the ice people need more help. The ice people need more help because they don't have any stone. See this guy? He's running in right now. Look at him go! Sword and shield in hand. He wants he wants blood. Oh, it's a, it's a woman and child. Oh, he, he ignored he ignored the children. Woman, yes, she's gonna fight him too. Look at she has like a sickle or something. What is that? That's bad. Oh, it's a forest fire. I'm gonna have to let these two duke it out. Let's go handle the forest fire. Let's rush over here. All oh, the forest fires getting out of hand. All oh, the forest fires getting out of hand. Okay. Great, great can handle this. Great can handle this. Here we go. Over there. And right over there. A little bit more in this side. There we go. Okay, don't let those fields burn. And I think we've got everything now. But we're going to have to regen the area. There we go. There we go. Area's looking freaking sweet now. Let's grab another regen. And is there anything else for me to regen, actually? I'm just going to throw one down here to make you guys a little bit happier. Impress them a little bit. So that's cool. We got raids going on over there. Let us, I'm going to fix that area up. The igloo folks need a better, better resources and stuff. Uh, let's, um, throw some rain down over here. 
and a little bit of regen as well to get everyone nice and happy. And I think there's a heretic hiding out in these buildings. I know there is. I saw you in here. There, oh, I just saw him. I just, right here. Right here. Ah, right here. Get out of here, dirty heretic. We have more heresy. More heresy right over here. We'll throw down a little bit of rain and we'll throw down a lot of heal. And I should bring everyone back to the light. Right over here, you have to go. And, oh, I see another one right on the water's edge. Oh, yeah. Grab them, and you're gone, too. I got to tell you, Deusim may not be the best for your back, but it's a cool game. All right. Let's help. Let's help. Another one? What's with the forest fires over here, man? Like, constantly with the forest fires. All right. Uh, rain, and I should be able to put this out before it even gets anywhere. I think that did it. I think that that's all that there is to that forest fire. I'm pretty sure anyway. Okay, yeah, that's it. Everything's looking okay over here. Now I know, though. Now I know what this game was talking about when it said eventually you're going to have too much to take care of. I don't want rain. I want regen. I totally get it because our, our area isn't even really that big. Oh, and already to go from side to side and, and front to back and back and forth and everything like that, it's actually not super easy. Now, I said I wanted to get over here. I'm finally going to do this now. We're going to put a mountain over here, and we're going to put another mountain over there. Actually, you know what? I'm going to put mountains all around here. I'm going to put one more mountain over there and one more mountain over there. And that should allow these areas to get built up, and this they need more space too. So let's put down that there and there. And you know what? We'll do it over here and over here and over here as well. And then let's put down... Now, I wonder... Could you essentially just void out an evil city? Like, would it just completely disappear? I don't know if I want to do that yet. I, I kind of, I want to leave that city there because I think it's pretty cool. Oh, wow, they slaughtered everyone. They straight up slaughtered everyone. Uh, hold on, let me see if I can, um, let me see if I can, like, do a little bit of, oh, do a little bit of healing over here. Help people out. Maybe a little bit of regen. Oh, this is interesting. This village isn't evil anymore. I don't really think I did anything particular to it or anything. That's kind of odd. Let's, um, let's get turned around this way and head over here for a little bit. Because we have some, we have some problems with, now if you remember, I think that this right over here was one of our very first cities right over here. And it still hasn't grown because we've never given it a mountain. So I think what I'm going to do is first I'm going to grab this guy. I wonder if I can get him in the volcanoes from here. Let's try. Ready? Ho! Oh, what do you think? You think the long bomber? Long bomber? Oh! <laughs> Hit the side of the mountain. Hold on. We got another We got another chance, though. We got another chance right here. Ready? Ready? It's like bowling. Bowling for... Ooh. That wasn't quite what I had intended. Oh, no! Right the down! <laughs> oh, that is absolutely horrible. I feel so bad. And yet, at the same time... So, not really caring about what we just did. Another person over here. Now, this dude has a sword and shield out. Are they gonna fight? Or, uh... Hold on. Let's, um... Let's go ahead and locust this area. There we go. Oh, yep! Yeah, see? Sent him running. Sent him running right over here. Got the sword and shield in hand. And the bra. The war bra. Right over there. Into the... Now nah, we're gonna miss it. That's right, though. We cleared him out. We clear them out. Let's give these folks over here a mountain. They need a mountain. Where do I want to make them a mountain? I think I'm going to make it over here by the water. So let's go ahead and void this area out like so. Not like that. And let us put a mountain right over here. There we go. And that should allow them... I think that should allow them to build up. At the very least, it'll allow these folks over here to build up. Yeah, right over there, we're getting some, some angry stuff going on. Wow. Man, having to take care of all this is a real pain. But that's fine. All right, we should be able to take care of this area fairly easily with a little bit of rain and maybe a little bit of regening. Are you guys happy about that? Yeah, most people are. There's like one dude over here that's... Uh-oh! Where's it at? Forest fire over there! Sorry, sir. I don't have enough time to mess with you. Gotta run past everything. Ah, uh, you know what? Hold on. Let's just teleport over. Uh, okay. Rain. Oh, everyone's burning alive. Everyone's burning alive. Please get the rain out. Please get the rain out. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Uh, there's a couple more people. Oh, Lord. A couple more people over here and over there. Oh, the fire has really spread. The fire has really spread. Long bomber! Yes! And the long bomb. Get... Oh, wow. There's still more fire. Okay. Hold on. More fire. Okay. I think... 
More fire! More fire! Oh, wow! Okay, this one spread. This one spread for real. I think there's more over there. There we go. Is everyone okay now? Let's zoom out a little bit here and take a look. Is everyone feeling a little bit better? I think with all the rain, too, everyone's a lot more impressed with our deism powers. Let's go ahead and regen the area. Uh-oh, plague. Um, heal. There we go. I think that should work. I'm pretty sure. Did it work? Did you guys, you all care about that? I just healed you. Are you impressed with it? I'll heal again. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Everyone enjoys that. Oh, we need a mountain over here. We need a mountain over here because, oh, you know what else we need? We need it. Oh, I wonder if I can pick up this tree and like beat you with it. Now it didn't look like it. I was hoping that like I could pick up that tree and beat that guy to death with it. I know that sounds terrible. I, I have a, the sinister nature of what I, yeah, it sounds pretty sinister. There's really no other way to talk about it. Let's go ahead and void this area out. Put a nice mountain down. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna, hmm. I'm gonna put down another mountain over here, as a matter of fact. Man, I love the void. The void is so good. Because like I said, it finally allows you to change things up a little bit. Ooh, we're auto-saving. Anytime you see the auto-save, I think that that pretty much means that some village just upgraded. That's the way it seems anyway. So, let, oh, let, you know what? Hold on. Something we haven't done in a little bit. Let's, um, yeah, let's just go over here. Let's check out our igloo village. Yes. I was going to say, because things should be getting a little bit better over here. We have, we, we do have a couple of heretics. And as a matter of fact, let's go ahead and grab one and get rid of them. Another one over here. Uh, you know what? Hmm. You know what? Hold on. You go over there for right now. And I think I'm going to fireball you. There it is. There it is. Yes. You know what? There's some locusts as well. Now you're on fire. And you're getting stung and eat or whatever by locusts. How horrible is that? Yes. Burned in a fiery, smoldering ash pile. You scumbag. That's what you get for trying to ruin the ice folks over here. Trying to bring sadness and despair to their lifestyles? I freaking think not. Oh, we have a... You see that? There was like a... Um, there was like a heretic that was just evil over there. You know what else we could do? We could make it so that... Hold on, let me turn a little bit. We could make it so that this area over here... Not this area, but that side is all evil people. Whoa, we got a raid going on. We got a raid going on. I'm here to help. Wah! I'm here to help. Anyway, what I was going to say is that side can be evil. This side can be like the good side and they can come across the water and fight one another. I think that would be pretty cool. Let's, um, let me see over here. I'm going to drop some rain on you guys. There we go. There we go. And you guys do need to have the, the fear. You do need to have a little bit of the fear. But then after locusting you, see, I'm going to heal everyone. They now look at how... It's like, it's like Stockholm Syndrome or something like that. Like, we're beating people down, and then we're, we're bringing them back up, and they love us for it. That's what's messed up about this game. So, what is this? There's still a couple of sad people over there. But yeah, I want all you guys to be happy. Everyone over here has to be happy. There's some more rain. Oh, look at this dude. Oh, no wonder. No wonder. We have people like this around here. That's what you get. That's what you get. You as well. Anyone else? Anyone else? Is everyone looking in fear now? Bam! Right to the canvas. Let's, um... Our faith is at 76%. We are a supreme deity. City's 41. Uh, Karma's at 80% right now. Okay. So, yeah. What we're gonna do is we're gonna keep this side as the non-evil side. Or the blue side, I guess. And that side as the red side. And we're gonna watch as they kind of, like, come in and attack one another. What would be really cool in this game, and I don't know if there is, I haven't seen it yet, is if there's, uh, sea battles. If there's, like, sea battles in this game, that would be amazing. Alright, so we do need a mountain over here, so that all these different villages can start to- Whoa! Oh, man, more forest fires over there. What is with the forest fires over here? Did I just splat someone, like, unintentionally? You know what, I'm gonna- I'm gonna go up for this. We're gonna take care of this like this. There we go. There we go. That should do it. Are we all clear now? Everyone good? I'm pretty sure everyone's good right now. I don't I think we've pretty much covered everything. Yeah, we have. 
Now we can go ahead and regen this. There we go. And what the heck, another regen right there, just because we can. These folks over here are getting a little uppity. That's fine, though. A little bit of rain never hurt anyone. That makes everyone pretty happy, it seems like. And you know what? I'm going to heal this area, too. And is that a tree? Hold on. This is really, really odd. There's a tree, like, dancing on this dude over here, and I don't know why. Why is this tree just hanging out in the middle of nowhere? Do we need this, or can I get rid of this? There we go. Wow. Ah. Uh, man, trees really fly. I had no idea. Anyway, what I wanted to do was void. Mm, am I going to kill all these people? How can I do this? How about right here? There we go. Void right there because I want to put down a mountain so that... Oh, cool. A desert mountain. Did we have those before? Maybe I just never made a mountain in the desert. I kind of like the desert mountains. They look they look pretty neat, actually. Um, I might make another one over here. But yeah, I want a desert mountain so that these people could have a way to get stone on this side. You can see all these different port cities over here, but they don't have a way to get any stone. So I'm going to bust that down. That's going to ruin that village right there, but that's okay because we're going to put a mountain down. Oh, that's interesting. It's a snowy mountain over there. Okay, whatever. That's fine. Oh, come here. Come here. Don't you hide inside the volcano. Oh, all right. Ribcage just went flying. I just smashed him into the volcano. Now, I just want to see what happens. What happens if we go over here and we fireball this area? Now, I don't want to, like, take these people out completely, but I just want to know what happens. So let's grab a fireball. Boom. Now, is this going to spread and, like, uncontrollably start destroying everything, I wonder? Let's watch this for a second over here. Oh, Gray, purging the world with fire and brimstone. No, it looks... Well, okay. Yeah, it does kind of get out of control. I don't want everything to burn. I just want some things to burn. There we go. Oh, we destroyed the whole city. We destroyed the whole city. Oh, man. Oh, I had no idea. Okay. Well, that's awful. Uh, I feel really bad about that. So, uh, in return, I'm going to go ahead and put down some mountains for you folks. So you can, like, rebuild and hopefully be slightly less sad. Oh, but terrible, Danny. Terrible. Holy crap, man. When we, let me, let me raise up a little bit so you guys can see. When we blasted that village, it changed the... Uh, the outlook on all the people in the area like there there was more evil cities over here And now there totally isn't like everyone is completely living in fear over there I wonder if I could grab the moon. Hold on. I'm very curious. This would be <laughs> Oh You gotta be kidding me Whoa, what happened? You can grab the moon! Look at how cool! The moon is super big now! Oh! Hold on! How high up can I go? Can I grab the sun? Oh, you can't grab the sun! That's crazy! How freaky would that be? If you were hanging around in your village and all of a sudden the moon got pulled down like that! I make my own eclipses around here. Oh, we got a raid going on. Look at this. Big raid going on over here. Look at them running through all the town, city, escape area. Like so. Let me get down nice and low for this. There's only a couple people left. And they're running. I'm going to give them some help. Because they're not supposed to be over here. I'm going to give them some help. Fireball. Fireball. That's what you get, scumbags. You think you can run around back in here in my beautiful city, destroy everything, and not face the fire and brimstone? Must be crazy. Must be crazy. You're going right toward the mountainside. May even land on a house. Bam! Right over there. Destruction and death wherever I go. Got another man over here chasing my people down. Wrong. Wrong answer, buddy. Off into the... The nebula with you into the Netherlands. We're gonna need to change the attitude over here. Let's uh, let's regen a little bit, and then we'll heal a little bit, and then we'll rain a little bit, and that should bring everyone pretty much back up to snuff. You can see faith low, probably because there's a heretic somewhere in there. Uh, you know what? Hold on. We're gonna we're gonna fix this up. Boom! There's the lightning. There's the fear-inspiring lightning. All right, man. Well, our world is getting real out of control. I mean, in a good way. Like, I love it. 
We got, <laughs> I put the moon down over there. So maybe that'll keep those people under wraps. Uh, we have several raids that we got to see, which is really sweet. I'm hoping to see more of that. Now we could do more swampy stuff. For right now, the swamp doesn't do a ton besides like make things a little bit annoying. The developer's looking for ways to fix that up. So if you guys have any suggestions on like what swamp could do, feel free to leave in the comment section below. I think that like making swamp just another place that you could live would be pretty sweet. You know what I mean? Like how you can live in the desert, you can live in the snow, you can live in the grasslands. It'd be cool if Swamp was just another place where you could live and there was like different types of houses and stuff that you would see. Just like how there's igloos and there's these cool houses over here. Like these, these mud or sand or adobe style houses. That's pretty sweet too. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed DSM. Until the next time, stay foxy and much love.